Lady Red and welcome to my channel, Lady Red's Tech Reviews. Today I've got a video for you. I've got a tutorial and it's going to be the first in a series because I've got my hands on an iPhone. i got a 6S Plus here and I'm going to be rolling out a few tutorials. Today we're going to do how to set up your iPhone, your brand new iPhone and your iCloud. So stay here, take a look, leave a like on the video, comment if you have any questions. And be sure to subscribe to my channel and ring my bell get the notifications. Thanks so much. Oh, and down in the description, there's a link for your iPhone, for your 6S Plus, because they are hard to come by these days. So stay here and take a look at the video. Click the link if you want to get yours today. got your new iPhone and you've turned it on, there's your power button and your SIM tray. Over here, you've got your volume rocker and your little back flip. Look at there. That's your sound. So, just turn. Alright, you want to get it started, hit your home key, pick your language. Select your region. We're going to do set up manually. <coughs> and this video is shot front to back with the Moto X Pure. Okay, Touch ID. We're going to go ahead and set that up later because that's very time consuming. And that's not what this one's about. Okay, you're going to have to make a passcode just for ease. We're going to do one, two, three, four, five, six. And yes, use it anyway. Make sure it's a passcode that you can remember because every time you open the screen on your iPhone, you will need that. All right. Set up as new. Now, I do have an Apple ID, but we're going to go ahead and um, make one just for the sake of the video and I don't remember what my password is so we're gonna make a new Apple ID let's see you wanna click create a free Apple ID if you are under 18 and you have your parents permission then absolutely change your birth date if not my birthday is gonna to be today that's today and I'm going to be born in 1986 My first name is Lady. My last name is Red. And you want to make, if you don't have an email, you can do a free one. And this is where you make it. Just like that. Yes, you want to create. Now you want to make a password. I'm not going to let you see mine. But a tip on passwords. Eight characters, just like it says. Eight characters, uppercase, lowercase, numbers. Always use a number. Okay, so you've made a password. Entered it twice. Next. And if it does that to you, just put this on, crap, just make a new one. We're going to pause again. Okay, so what I did, I used the same one because it's easy to remember and I added an exclamation point at the end. That usually takes care of it. And you're not getting my phone number. Okay, so it's going to put in a phone number. As you can see, I don't have a SIM card in this, so I'm going to check it in a text message the phone number I put in there and you're not going to see that either but it will be in a text and it will have right there your Apple ID verification code so we go back over here to the iPhone and we put the verification code in And that's all you have to do. Now you agree to terms and 
conditions. And then we wait three minutes. And this is what we have now. Express settings. Continue. I'm not even messing with that. And then we wait some more. From front to back, if you're creating a new Apple ID, this takes less than 10 minutes. Depending on how strong your Wi-Fi is and the speed on your Wi-Fi. Mine's not that great. We got 20 phones and three computers on the Wi-Fi right now. I know I hit that. There we go. Okay. Apple Pay, I'm not bothering with, so we're going to set up later. No, I don't want to use the iCloud keychain. I'm not bothering with Siri right now. No, I don't want to share anything. No, I don't want to share anything. Now you're going to choose your view. So it just depends on your personal preference here, um, how you want it. You can have it like this. Or you can zoom it in. And I prefer a zoomed in because I don't always want to put on my glasses just to look up the phone. Get started and that's it. That's how you set up. Okay. Right that's how you set up your new iPhone. That's how you make your iCloud account. There you go. Alright, so now you know how to set up your new iPhone if you've never had one before and how to make an iCloud account if you've never had one of those before. Thank you so much for watching this video with Shout Front to Back with the rear camera on the Moto X Pure. So tell me what you think. Leave a comment down below. And I'm going to put a link in the description because the 6S Plus is what I'm using today and they're very hard to find now because they've been discontinued. So I'm going to stick a link down there in the description if you want to get one for yourself. It's a very popular phone, a very good device. I highly recommend it if you're going to go the iPhone route and you don't want to spend, you know, more than your rent. So, thanks so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't done that. And ring my bell, get the notifications, and I'll see you in the next video.